What did I just fucking say? What did I say on my previous video? So if you don't know, I have made a whole video, which was this one, about 5v5 discussions and especially Bastion's rework and how I hate it so much. And you have 32 minutes, 33 minutes of absolute destruction. Where I think about the problems of Bastion and how to fix them. So yeah, it took me 32 minutes to say everything I want to say. But after that, by the way, I also uploaded this to Reddit and for some reason it got taken down saying that I was aggressively promoting something. It wasn't Reddit, it wasn't the uh, mods who there were there were comments about me aggressively promoting my VTuber channel and whatever. Bro, I wouldn't make 33 minutes of just me speaking about Bastion self-promoting aggressively. I just happened to be playing Overwatch and got tilted and then spoke while the matchmaking was going on. And guess what? It went for 37 minutes. About 37 minutes if I remember correctly. But anyway, we return to yesterday, where Overwatch actually, <laughs> let me show you, Overwatch actually buffed the damage roll and gave them a new passive. I don't care about the increased reload speed because it doesn't matter for Bastion, especially in the uh, sentry form. You basically don't even have reload anymore. You have infinite ammo in these 6 seconds. So yeah, I care about the speed. If it also stacks with sentry mode, then that means it's a lot faster. It's about, I don't know how the fuck percentages work, but if I'm correct, it should be 75% because right now it's 50% if I'm correct. So yeah, 75 is a lot better, even if it's still slower than other heroes, especially if they also well, got speed from eliminations, it will be hard to chase them down, but still, it's a lot better than nothing. And then we go to my boy, Bastion. Yes, I like what I see. It's in this correct path. I just don't think that it's enough. Let me explain. Or you know what? Let my past self explain. This is what I wanted them to do. So I definitely do not like the new recon mode uh, gun. And when it comes to my idea for Ironclad, I think that all you need to do is add a system. And that system is when Bastion damages enemies. He gains, like, bit by bit, he gains this shield. Just like how Zarya gains a shield by being damaged. Or, uh, she doesn't gain a shield, she gains da more damage while being damaged. Make it so Bastion as much, uh, as long as he damages the enemy, he gains uh, damage resistance. And once he stops damaging, like it can go on for like 4, uh, four to 5 more seconds before it slowly drops or just goes away. And I think that's a great way to make Bastion more resistance. And By the way, I apologize for the mic. Uh, I already apologized down here. So, <laughs> yeah, I bought a new mic just for you. I don't know who you are, actually. But yeah, I just want to know one thing. Yep, 37 minutes of just searching for a match. Holy fucking shit. So, yeah. I do like the 20% damage reduction while transformed, however, I think the real problem is not in sentry form, sentry form is okay, it's good, other than it doesn't chase down enemies as good as it should be, and that is fixed with DPS hero uh, passive role. So yeah, the actual problem for me is that recon mod is too weak. Recon mode is the one who cannot face most enemies in the game because they will crush him, especially in closer regions. And if you're playing sentry form, 
you will be in closer ranges because it's less effective in far ranges so once you transform you have six seconds you rush them down try to kill them and then suddenly what do you get you transform back to Rico mode and now you're in this awkward position where you're in close range of I don't know how many enemies but still they're much stronger than you in that range unless you're like super passive and want to use sentry form just from the back as extra damage this may work but I don't know I just don't see it as fun they want to make uh, heroes more fun and they don't see that so yeah they're supporting camping especially with artillery how it's made they're supporting that you just sit in the back and shoot from the back lines which is super boring let's be real and since you're basically locked out of sentry form for 12 seconds that means you'll be using recon mode for about at most or at least 67 percent of the time so yeah i don't see it as fun i don't see it as a rework it has no synergy at all bastion doesn't have any way of healing himself from self damage all other heroes have a way to maintain full hp even while rocket jumping and bastion does not have that he rocket jumps and he just loses hp each time he does it unless someone else heals you and i already explained that i had one reddit uh, reply where i literally explained it and they were like hey but uh, faraz and zarya and soldier they're like also damage themselves it's it's common it's no no it's not common it shouldn't be common because they can recover from it Zarya has blue HP, she can recover. Farah doesn't even need to damage herself. I mean, you can damage yourself, but you don't need to. You already have two abilities that make you go to the sky. And Soldier, he ha he heals the whole team. He doesn't even just heal himself. So yeah, other than that, I don't have anything to say. Other Everything else you can see in the previous video I showed you. That's what it's called, so... I don't have anything else to say. Oh wait, can I do my usual outro with this mic? Wait a second. Get the fuck out.